In all the proud annals of the Royal Canadian Mounted Police, pony soldiers as the Indians called them, none is more exciting than this true story, told exactly as it happened, of how one pony soldier challenged an entire renegade tribe on the warpath. Desperate with hunger, Standing Bear's tribe of Cree Indians illegally left their reserve to hunt buffalo and raid their enemies, the Sioux and Blackfeet, across the border in the United States. They plundered and burned until... Who did this? American Long Knives, looking for Sioux. They don't know the difference between the Cree and Sioux. We will teach them the difference. It's Tyrone Power as Constable Duncan McDonald, Cameron Mitchell as Kona, whose knife was thirsty. Thomas Gomez as Natayo, the half-breed. Anthony Earl Numkina, the orphan Indian boy who adopted Constable McDonald as his white father. Henny Edwards, the white captive over whom a deadly battle was fought. But if the pony soldier tries to steal the white woman, I will cut out his heart and dry his scalp behind my lodge. Kona has spoken. There will be no marriage. The prisoners shall go unharmed and free. The pony soldier has spoken. Do you want to help me, Duncan comes running? Yes, of course. You go stay with the white girl. If anyone tries to harm her, come and warn me. Only talk an Indian understands is hot lead in his belly. The Indian figures that's the only language the white man understands. And right now, there are about a thousand of them out there who are thinking just that way. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 